was a very important step because it's the second time we could participate in that event and it was um, a great event despite the weather. We had lots of people, lots of music, lots of products and everyone was interested in our project. Uh, compared to last year I think we had a great success because we, we sold more pro uh, products from Peru and Mexico. Um, we had more people coming towards us, uh, some people actually recognized us and um, despite the weather, we had a great result. Uh, Lipos Creatividad y Más um, stands for Books, Creativity and More. And that's basically what we want to provide to children because uh, it provides basic skills which they can use their whole life, uh, which they can use to improve their living situations. And uh, it's, in a sense, it's things that they don't usually have in the places where they're living because there's very isolated um, locations and the uh, focus in those places is on other things. So one major project that we're having is the creation of a library in a small village called Colola in Mexico um, and then we're also trying to do similar work and creative um, workshops and English lessons in Peru for instance. Since last year we've been able to obtain more volunteers. We're having about seven, eight volunteers now helping out in events. Um, we also had our first travelling volunteer going to Mexico. Uh, we completed four weeks staying there um, successfully, uh, which surely was an interesting experience for him. Um, what we also like to do in the UK is obtain more contacts to schools and also involve um, a British school in the Inter Exchange um, to animate them a bit more to learn Spanish and then also the Spanish kids or Mexican kids and goes from Peru to learn English. But, um, there's one school in Germany which is supporting the project. The children learn about the culture, uh, also get more uh, interest in learning the languages and actually find uh, friends in the other places of the world. They're baking cakes and selling them to raise funds for the project, but they're also um, preparing little works uh, themselves uh, which we're exchanging with Mexico and Peru. In order to do something, you don't need to do a lot. You can do it with little money, with little time, a little bit of contact, and uh, we would welcome everyone who would like to join us, either abroad or here, as a school, as a volunteer, which is someone offering some time or even some knowledge that we could need.